Let him eat Steve-O. What's on the list? Fuck a lot of stuff at the moment. Just the normal stuff. Corona, I see. Corona. That's the main thing. <laughs> Star next to that one. Yeah. Uh, it's like yellow. I'm just finding all the parts you drop on the floor for you. Yeah. So, it's actually thinking, yeah. as long as that's not too low, you could bolt there yeah. at the top. We'll just make a blade on the bottom. Yeah. 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 But yeah, if you guys want to yeah. split, it'll want to split all the way down. How about I do yeah, this? No, How about I see if I can find a four piece, four inch piece of scrap, yeah. and I'll do what I can with it, yeah. and see what, and yeah. give you what yeah. I can yeah. give you. All right? Thank you. Yeah, that's not. That's my junk. Very nice. What's it run? Uh, I went 580s at 120 on a 250 yeah. shot. We're at the exhaust shop at the moment. What do we just pick up? Uh, a heap of uh, th uh, four inch pipe tube to make exhaust. Uh, they come out the back of the turbos. Some helpful guys, it's called uh, butlers, bufflers and brakes. It's pretty warm out here. I'm gonna go back and uh, grab some more beer and start plumbing up the exhaust. My name's Scott Ruggles. I own Scott's Butler's Muffler and Auto Repair in Leavenworth, Kansas. I met these guys. They came in needing some parts and pieces for the car. Uh, real good guys, and I'm glad to help them out. What are you installing here? A uh, battery cable. And how long is it? 15 foot. Three foot too long. Welding the fuel tank so we can put a holy float bowl on it. Keep the level right. I want to see how good you, good <laughs> you can't weld. Oh, well, fun, yeah. You got to be better than me. I own the machine. I can't do it. Really? No. Nope. Here's, here's All ready to go. Let's go whack it in. Ate a lifter on the last fucking day, so I had his engine pulled apart, put oh, the really? lifters in it, and I'm like, dude, this is fucking stupid. And on the way home, I told Dan, I said, I am never doing this shit. Yeah. This, yeah. this is the dumbest fucking thing yeah. you guys ever drug me through. We said the same Two thing. weeks later, yeah. $25,000 loan, let's get my shit rolling because we're going on drag week. You yeah. know, you're like, fuck. Fuel tank front. Done. 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 How's the view? It's a sweet, sweet view. That's a $200 tar shaft. And we got quoted a thousand dollars. The guy before this, and this guy's done a pretty neat job. And four days. He's done it the next day, and he built two of them, so we got a spare. That's fucking nothing. The weight, and they're both on one side. What? Spare uni, spare bang in. Yeah. Good job. 
If it's not leaving black marks by tomorrow night, I'll be disappointed. How fast is your car going to run? Yeah. I'll wait for you at half track with my ratty exhaust. <laughs> I didn't say it, he did. <laughs> twin turbo get, twin turbo big block get beat by small block in A. Only if the crank's hanging out of it. <laughs> <laughs> I want my 20 bucks on D-Day. I'll be collecting. <laughs> no, I'm going to be collecting. Where's the piece of tape? This is the bet board. Okay, okay. Last day. Okay. You gotta get some more bets going. Anybody makes a bet, this is where it goes. Me and Harry got a bet at $20. He says the last day he will run sevens in this car. I said, you run, you show me sevens, I'll give you 20 bucks. How much are you giving him? Huh? How much are you giving him if he runs a seven? 20 bucks. You're gonna give me 20 bucks. So I need a $10 pay rise if you wanna run seven. So you don't only gain ten dollars if you run sevens. This will be the easiest money ever. <laughs> hey, Australian dudes, this is what we've got done today. This is our list. Uh, today we've uh, got a few more ticked off. We've got brake lines, new brake lines sorted out. Got them bled up. Fuel tank in the back. Got that sorted out. Got our new front header tank, which is uh, the standard fuel pump's going to pump into the header tank, then we're going to run our big pumps for the uh, EFI off that, just so we've got big capacity at the back, so we're not chasing fuel every 10 minutes. Uh, what else we've got in here? We've uh, tightened all, fixed all the bolts on the diff, I uh, had to adjust that, get it central, got the diff topped up with oil, uh, got our intercooler in, got our battery, all our battery leads made up today, got all that sorted, and uh, what else we got here? Made the exhaust off the turbos, we've got all that sorted out. Um, what did you do to get that done? Uh, that was, trying to buy exhaust tube in America seemed to be hell, but we finally found a guy who was awesome and no, couldn't help us enough, brought stuff around and it was mint. So we went to the star performance yesterday for all our cooler pipes and that was a nightmare. They just had shiny stuff that was crap. So we've sent all that back and we've got another guy bringing us some tomorrow. Uh, Shannon's got the bumpers all done, got all them fitted up, giving them a bit of a patina. And uh, what else did we do? We've got, yeah, the tail shaft man turned up. We've got two tail shaft made, we've got one spare. We've got that done, we've got the um, tail shaft loops done. And I forget what else, but there's probably more, but yeah. So, so far so good. This time tomorrow night, we should uh, have a fire in the hole and see if we're all good. Time to leave some lines outside. Yes, sir. And we've got the police band coming tomorrow night, so it should be interesting. So stay tuned. Enjoy. Just come around here, tack some intercooling pipe. We'll go and check, see if it fits, finish the rest of it, and come back and weld it up. Yep. Put some silicon around. I know. You're a you're a fan, but the thing is, it's Cutting the hood. We're gonna make it work. Uh, if it don't work, or it should have, ain't it? All right.